Hello everyone. It's uh I'm uh today we're talking about America. Again, I guess. And I'm not just Donald Trump being impeached or potentially being the first president to be done properly. Or being a, a, an absolute idiot. What's talking about mass shootings in America? What's your opinions on gun laws, right? Look at it like this. We live in a country with 300 million people on the, constitu on the constitution written 200 years ago that you have not changed. Billy, you got what? You got the Fifth Amendment. I think it's like 12 in 200 years to the, the original constitution. What does that show, right? Your founding founders were born all across the world. Your first president wasn't even born in your country. He was born. In one of the big European islands. This is what I believe. America, the land of opportunity. America, the land of racists. America, the land of hating immigrants, even though your whole country are immigrants. America, hating people because they're native to the land you are not. America, hating people because you can hate people. America, where uh, policies make no sense, uh, you have any health care, you have to pay for health care, and it can put you into debt, and it should kill you not having insurance, it can kill you not having a job, it can kill you um, to take sick days off, it can kill you to go to school, it can kill you to go to work, it can kill you to even do a running, go running. What am I looking at running? The Boston Marathon bombings. You can't go anywhere in America and be safe, especially the worst place to be going at the moment is schools. Who would think going to school in America would be the place to die, the place to fear for your life? You'd think it'd be maybe a nightclub or even a crowded square, but no, the worst place to get killed, the most of the place to get killed in America is school shootings. By statistics, <laughs> like on like you see on average, like the worst place you get most killed in one place is school. Why? Because schools aren't designed to stop mass shooters. You say they are. You got doors. You can shoot through doors. You can shoot through windows. People can shoot through fucking tables. Um, and America. The place of opportunity, the place you can die with slippery things and someone doesn't disagree with you. America, where land opportunity can turn to land of slavery. And as you say, there's no slave labor. What about prisons? There's not slave labor. We pay people to fucking pay money. We pay money to the prisoners to make them work. They have no fucking choice. Where, where prisons are used as as free labor, pretty much. America, the country where if we can't see it, nothing's happened. America, the place where you want to do something <laughs> and it doesn't happen. America, where if you if you have citizenship and you leave, you pay lots of money. America, where we well, also when you go overseas. Banks were taking money. Overseas banks were taking money because they hate reporting to the Americans. America, the, the only place, the bar Ethiopia, which makes fucking sense for Ethiopia, where, where you, being American, is fundamentally more difficult. America, the place where you spend so much money on education, yet a lot, you, you, you go to college. Students can't afford to pay their debt back, even if they do get the job they want. America, the place where you let people spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on art scholarships, on art programs, that you know they're not going to get their money back because you know you'll get money from them. America, where everyone gets taken advantage of, especially, yeah. America, when people say, oh, Rich people will give them their money, give them money to triple down. You know that's not going to happen. 
it's America, the place where you give it to the people, and uh, all across the news they say, oh, the worst decision in history. I'm like, America, the place where no one can grab anything. America, where you only have two choices, the far left or the far right. America, where you people like Donald Trump doing, doing stuff and trying to get away with it. And uh, America, the place where you storm the capital and say it was peaceful um, occupation, where you know it's not peaceful occupation, you know that storming the capital, getting inside the capital building is illegal, and then saying you didn't do it, when you sat on your freaking platform and spoke to the people for going, them going there. America. America. No. United States of America. Place where there's 50 states, and Hawaii technically shouldn't be part of America. Where you took it over in 1958 from the English, and you absolutely wiped out the main, wiped out the indigenous people from Hawaii. Because it's so bloody expensive. There's no way indigenous people can live there. America, where, yes, and how we go to this point, where they only recognize the Native American Indians, not the Native Hawaiians. America, where you go into the Northern Marianas and you absolutely bomb assholes. You and the French. Um, America, the land of opportunity, the land of depression, the land of, oh, if you're a man, you're the problem. The land of radicalists. You say you aren't radicalists. You 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 are the far one way or far the other. There's, there's not much in between, you know. You have every culture under the sun in your country, but people get the most of Muslims. I put you that more walls have been over religion in history than anything. Yes, I'm tired. I'm sick still. Well, I'm a red. America, where hating Muslims is a sport because they blew up the Twin Towers. Well, they didn't even blow up the Twin Towers. Actually, they did. America, where you, on the alone, you have to get debt first. Takes no fucking sense. I understand having been you know you can pay money back, but having to take out credit card or two of them or three of them and have it just because not that you need it, just because you have to have it to work credit. Uh, America, we house prices are cheap, but your food is crap. America, we have been super sized. And that's why your influence on Pacific Islands has been the worst thing ever. Because you see the places like Moa, places like Tonga, like you see all them having the American influence. You see places like um, American Samoa. How did the Americans get into Samoa? I'll offer you protection. Just like you offer all Northern Marianas, Saipan, fucking. I wonder what that was. <laughs> My flat rate's making something, I don't know. America, where you have no rights to medical care. And I'll leave you on this. Medical debt is the most crippling thing in America. It's, it's the word, it's literally, they can make a number out of the hat. They say, oh, it's this much. But if you don't have an insurance adjuster or any insurance to fill them to haggle with, unless you're good at haggling, you, you'd pay over the odds. Um, talking about, yeah. There was a study, right? In comparison, to be a doctor in America, you can make something up to like, Five hundred thousand USD a year. In New Zealand, you probably get paid maybe eighty, eighty-five, ninety, which is what forty 
45,000 US a year? Not even that. So no wonder all the people go there. I would too if I had that, that skill that would pay me millions of dollars. So to leave you um, on that, America, the home of the free, place the land of the brave, and country that fucks up every country because they have interests there and they don't want you to steal their shit. Goodbye. Click there for a random video. Click there to subscribe and click there to to to, to uh, num, num, num. subscribe to expensive investments. Bye.